hello everyone welcome to the channel in this video guys i'm going to guide you whether you should install windows 11 24 as 2 or not so first of all i will categorize this video into two parts if you have gamer guys so windows 24 as 2 is not recommended for you but if you have already done it and somehow your system automatically install it then you can roll it back but if you don't have the option to install it so that is good option for you microsoft is rolling out the update in a different segments so on the search bar when you type a winver and you open that up and you can see in my case i have 24s2 latest version and that is working fine in my system but i have seen the comments and watched the video on the youtube as well as known issues as on the microsoft website that many of the user is not able to use their system properly system is not responding so those users should have the options to uninstall the update and let's talk about the known issues as guys first of all first issue has been resolved you can see the status the second one is usb device that supports scan protocol may be discoverable that is also resolved now you can see the third option here select games might stop responding on windows 11 version 24 s2 so especially if you are a gamer so this version is not recommended for you as of now so when we'll open a new link here a lot of brief options you can see here the game names as well So Microsoft has also recommended to you that don't install the manually update version using the Windows 11 installation and assistant media creation tool until this issue has been resolved. And let's talk about some of the other issues as well, which may affect your system. These are the resolved issues, mitigated, disk disk can be more and especially if you are the asus user if you have asus devices so it might fail the windows 24 s2 on your laptop or system so don't go for windows latest version as of now if you have you can uninstall it i will show you how you can uninstall the latest version of 24 s2 later one of the known issues i have faced in my system so as you can see here this issue i have faced in my system date and time in windows setting might not permit user to change the time zone when you start to change the time and date here directly with the right click so that is not working so when i put the password and username so you can also go to the control panel and change the time and date from there so if your system is not responding and you are facing any kind of issues with blue screen or other resources on your system so you can uninstall the latest update of windows 24s2 how to do that you just need to click on start then click on settings and inside here go to windows update and windows update once you open that you need to go to update history and click on uninstall update and you should able to see all the updates you have done on your system so you need to have the option of uninstall update especially 24s2 just select that option and before selecting the option of this uninstall just pause your system pause update for for four weeks and also untick this option if it is on like this you need to untick this option get the latest windows automatically when available and then go to update uninstall the update of 24s2 and after that you should able to go back to windows 23s2 of windows 11 so this is how guys if you have installed the 24s2 and you want to roll it back you can do that so if you are not facing any kind of issues with the windows 24 s2 update so leave your system as 24 s2 
so i hope guys this video helps you if yes then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching